Hey, I'm proud of myself. That was that was a whole lot easier than I was expecting it to be. I wanted to make myself a second one of these because I need it for a uh, blue scroll, and I, d I did it without having to look any- I, I, I remembered! I'm proud of myself! And and then I realized it's literally pull pull levers in in a circle, and then uh, a baby could do it. But hey, I'm proud of myself. I made a, I made a mind shield. It's cool. Well then. Uh... Rip everything, I guess. What the hell? Right, and with this, this is the last inventory of Mot My Fungus that I need to collect. Boom, there we go, 1,022. These are really not that bad. I think this took me about 40 minutes, 50 minutes maybe. So, yeah, it's not too bad, and they're fairly chill to do. But from my calculations, once I've made all of these, I'm still going to need to make 300 of these. Um, which I am not looking forward to. Alright, it's not the most impressive thing, but there you go, 70 million total XP on the Iron Man account. And that is my 1000 super energies made. I need to go decant them and put them in there, but that is a good amount of them. How far am I away from 982? I'm 20k XP away. Uh, I'm gonna see how much stuff I need to get. Is I think the only herbs that I really have are dwarf weeds. So yeah, I'm gonna have to uh, go and collect myself some um, wines of Zamorak. Okay, so I collected uh, wines of Zamorak for as long as I could stand, which was about uh, 70, I think. And it turns out I am 108 XP away, and I just went on a farm run. And yeah, uh... There we go, 82 Herblore, super weapon poison, nice, uh, drop that, <laughs> I'm never going to use it. Yeah, there we go, that is the 82 Herblore achieved, which means I can now get try and get a plus 5 boost to make myself uh, anti-venoms. Okay, so basically I decided I wanted to go to Zami for the end of my uh, task here. And first thing I thought I was going to do was a boost to do Blood Barrage, but I don't have any magic pots. So I was going to just buy a Wizard Mind Bomb, uh, and then I realized I could go to Miscellanea to get myself some Lantern Dimes, because I am completely out, which is why I was resorting to Wizard Mind Bombs anyway. So let's go to Miscellanea and hope they have some Lantern Dimes for me. Otherwise, I'm going to be in trouble. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Do it again. Do it again, but better. Yeah. Sure. How how rare is a ruby? Is this... Are you sure you want to know? I don't want to know, but I feel like you're gonna tell me either way. One in six thousand two hundred. <laughs> oh, one in. S oh wait, no. One in one thousand six hundred twenty-five. Okay, I was gonna. Like I was gonna say six thousand. What the fuck? Yeah. Dude! I'm not even um, joking, I got the spear! <laughs> I'm not even joking! Wait, is that two hilts on a pet, though? <laughs> I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry, dude! I'm running like 250 kills. <laughs> oh my god, that's so cool! I didn't even revert my tab, so I'm just stood on top of Trollheim. Yeah. <laughs> just holding his Zami Spear in Trollheim. Living life. Jesus. Living life. First, first actual death. That... Oh, I've got one kill left in my task as well. Gotta get kill count again for one kill. I'm... Okay, so I wasn't expecting that, and I just hit 88 ranged. I completely forgot how close I was to that level. Yeah, as you can see, I got a shaman task, so I'm... Oh, well, I got a lizardman task, so I'm doing shamans. Sorry about my mouse, my dog is licking my arm. So every time he licks, my, uh, my mouse goes off to the right. And... Ooh, hang on, run away from this purple guy. Uh, yeah, that is another Zeric Talisman. These are meant to be pretty damn rare, but I get them super commonly, so... I think this is my fourth or fifth one from these guys, and... I haven't killed that many, only like a couple hundred, so... Yeah, sorry to anyone who hasn't got one of these yet, but uh, I've got some to spare. 
Hey, look. Another one. And that is the end of the Lizardman Shaman's task. These things actually have pretty damn good drops. Yeah, how many... I can just talk to anyone, yeah? Uh, how many Lizardmen have I killed? I've only killed 350 Shamans, but yeah. Basically, uh, I've been skipping this task for quite a while because I didn't want to use the bow and all of that. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to start doing it every time I get it now. I'm not going to bother with... Well, I can't bother, use Braces of Slaughter, but yeah. I'm going to gonna start trying to build up my KC as much as I can, but now let's go get another task. Right, I just got a blue dragon task and I didn't really think about it and um, I just realized this blue dragon task means that I get to use my Hasta, well spear, I'm gonna have to go uh, turn it into a Hasta. Also somehow I've managed to end up filling my, oh I figured out how I filled up my bank. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to go turn this into a Hasta, I think it costs 250k so I should be able to afford it, yeah there we go. But let's head over to Otto and get him to do this. Okay so I'm not actually sure what I'm meant to do with this, but I think if I just use the Haster on him, of 300k, is that's more than I thought it was. Hey, oh, we get a, a little animation. And hey, it's converted my spear into a Haster, and we now have our Zami Haster. Nice. Looks so cool, dude. <laughs> I can't believe I got this. Okay, so I just finished my uh, black uh, blue dragon task. And with these bones, there you go. I have now hit the 1,000 dragon bone mark. Uh, I don't know how much XP this is. I'm f uh, off the top of my head, I think they're 250 each, and then with the wildy ult, you get twice that. So I've got uh, about half a million prayer XP there, right there. And I just got myself a dark relic from raids on uh, 10. Still don't have my... Uh, my preserve yet, which is a bit upsetting because I actually got the uh, tablet and preserve AC1 on my main, which is uh, pretty friggin' cool. But yeah, Dark Relic, I think this goes in any skill that you use in raid, so obviously that is Herblore. Yeah. 12,000 XP, damn. There we go. 12k XP. Really quick medium glue. Oh, a penguin mask, I think I already have it. Wait, 100k? Is that in the dig site teleports? Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Uh, let's see, do I actually have this? Yep, right, to the table in Edgeville. So yeah, I'm gonna block elves, because not a good task. Right, let's see, what are we gonna get? Our inspectors. I literally just did a task of these. Go again, I guess. Okay, so I don't know if this is gonna make a whole load of sense. Basically, I was just doing this Black Demon task, and I was thinking about how I'm not really a huge fan of Black Demon tasks. Oh, we just, it just, it just hit 1 a.m. All right, well, all of my dailies have reset. But yeah, uh, and I'm not really a fan of Black Demon Tasks, but I kind of didn't know if I wanted to block them or not because I still want to get the next Zenite Jewelry. So I was looking into uh, what levels I would need to get uh, different, uh, to get the different things. Because I obviously, like, um, if they're not that far away, um, I can just get... Uh, get the levels and do the black demon tasks and then block them basically uh, so I looked into it and I'm gonna need about 3,000 seaweed or giant seaweed to be able to get myself to 90 crafting and I'm going for 90 because that will get me the anguish and the tormented bracelet I'm not gonna worry about the fury yet because personally I'm not a huge fan of the fury I don't think it's worth it really and getting those three levels will take a long ass time uh, so I probably would just stop at the Tormented for the for the time being. Uh, and yeah, I need 3,000 Seaweed, which if, if I can remember correctly, that means I'll need 18,000 Sand, which is about what I collected in the first place, to be honest. So it's it won't actually be that bad, but I haven't been farming Seaweed since I got my Fury. Uh, so I'm going to have to get back on that so that I can get it sooner rather than later. Well... Let's let's just uh, let's just sit here and admire that. Oh, dude, my second Zenite shard. Ooh, uh, how many kills do I have left in my task? Twenty. So this is about six hundred and fifty KC, more or less. Um. So yeah, that's that's nice. I've actually caught up with my RNG. I was kind of worried that I was gonna go very dry and like all of them would take about six hundred. But you know what? as long as as long as it balances out, I'm not too worried. 
There you go, Xenite Shard number 2. Now I really do have an incentive to get myself up to 87 crafting for the Anguish. Okay, so as I said a few clips ago, uh, it's going to take me about 3,000 uh, giant seaweed to get to 90 crafting. If I need 3,000 giant seaweed, I need 18,000 buckets. Uh, thankfully, I don't have to empty compost anymore, because a few updates back, they made it so that there's bucket packs in general stores. Yeah, there we go. Only 15 per world? Yeah, this is, this is going to make it so that getting 18,000 buckets is going to be so much easier. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to stop at 15,000 because I've already got about 1,000 in my bank. And I've already got about 1,000 buckets in my bank and I don't know how many more I'm going to get from uh, various things. And they're fairly easy to go get myself more of anyway, so I'm not hugely worried about it. Uh, but yeah, that is 15,000 buckets. There we go, 16,000. Alright, so I actually forgot I planted this. But yeah, my spirit tree is fully grown. I get to check health on it. I don't know how much XP I get for this. Hopefully it's a good amount. Nearly 20k XP, damn. But yeah, now I've got my teleport to Brimhaven. Uh, but yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. Nice. First one I've ever had of these. I got another seed earlier as well, so I got tons. Uh, I just realized that when... Uh, I hit 82 Herblore, I can now make my uh, super weapon poisons. And um, after doing these, I'm thinking this probably isn't worth it. Uh, it's pretty good XP per thing, but I need to farm poison berries and I need to farm these and I need to make the coconuts. So I don't think it's really worth it. I think it would be better just. Uh, not having the uh, bush for poison berries and having it on white berries and then just making them into super defense pots. Like obviously I get less XP from the like each of the berries that I get. I get 150 instead of 140 but I think just the general time saved is worth it. Also uh, not having to make a lot of these things is just it's just a whole lot nicer. So yeah, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna bother farming uh, cave nightshade anymore. And next time I go on a uh, bush run, I'll probably change my uh, poison ivy bush out for a white berry bush. Farming magics is so good, dude. They're such good XP. <laughs> uh, I never really got to do them before this account, but yeah, there we go. 82 uh, farming. That doesn't get me anything. Okay. Right, I'm doing the uh, the Halloween event, and this dude just asked for some uh, some cow's blood. I'm I'm calling it now. This guy's gonna be doing some form of ritual or something. Yeah, let's let's get this guy's cow's blood, because that's not weird at all. He was like, uh, only for only for decoration, and this says for cosmetic purposes only. Apparently, a hundred percent, he's gonna be doing a ritual. Also Damn, he's got the magical aptitude of a level 3 skiller, but with less charisma. Throwing shade at level 3 skillers, what the fuck. Goddamn wee wee, are you serious? <laughs> Dude, I fucking called it, he summoned a demon. How did he end up something? But I suppose he did it on accident. I, I thought he was going to do it purposefully. I thought that was the plan all along, but he's just an idiot. Dude, I'm not okay with this. Clowns creep me the fuck out. This is we. I don't like it. I realize it's the point of it that it's meant to be spooky, but I am not okay with this right now. What the hell? Boy, we got Eek! Dude, can I equip Eek? Yeah! <laughs> Hang on, what, what's Eek's stats? This is, this is important. Nice. Uh, this, on the other hand, is uh, getting destroyed, and I am never going to think about it again. I'll be perfectly happy never thinking about these again. Eek's good though, I like Eek. Uh, I decided since it's Halloween I was gonna have give myself a bit of a makeover and uh, so I went so I thought you know what it's Halloween so let's go with like the torn clothes and a pale skin uh, and then because I, I'm, I'm a little blue robot I had to go with the blue hair. Yeah I've got a new hairdo and everything but yeah new character let's go. Alright I've got a hard casket here I also did an elite step because I just did my, uh, I just did the quest quest cape 
emote in the old man's house, but let's see, are we going to get anything good? Uh, not really. Oh, come on, it's the wrong one. I have TNG now, no legs. Alright, I just got my elite task for uh, farming dwarf weed here, so yep, that's pretty cool. Also, while I was on the train yesterday, I did a birdhouse run and I got 74 herb... Uh, 74 hunter, sorry. So I'm now able to do magic, uh, magic birdhouses, and I don't think I have any other need for uh, um, magic logs, so I'm going to move on to those instead of doing use. Right, I just decided to quickly uh, make some more of these elite stash units. I think there's four or five I can make, so here's another one, and here's a second. And here's the third one. Uh, I think there's. I think I'm just gonna quickly check the list. I can make uh, one more relatively easy, and then I'll need to get myself a second pair of dragon boots uh, and a black salamander and a rune crossbow. Those are the only, th those are the easiest ones to make. And here is another one. I had to head over into. The... Well, this is the master one. Ah. Yeah, I had to head into the wilderness to get myself nails. Okay, let's try again. Yep, then that is another one. Alright, I had to go into the uh, God Wars dungeon to get myself a second pair of dragon boots. Luckily, I... Uh... Nails! Right, I have everything this time. There we go. The things in the stash unit. Beautiful. And here is another one. I should have everything for it. Yeah. Nice. Look at that. Here is another one. I had to go to a uh, crazy archaeologist to uh, get more rune crossbows. But there we go. It's on me right now. Because, you know, <laughs> it's important to have plenty of tridents. You gotta don't forget your trident switches. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of people to play ultimate now. Uh, can, can I just stop you for a second? Yeah. Um, I just got a second jar of dirt. <laughs> yeah, look at uh, Kraken's. Pretty right. funny, because you're getting loads of all the non-tentacle or, you know. Right, can we... You need tentacle or pet, and you're getting like, endless tridents and jars. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that was great. Ah, oh, Jesus. Alright, I've been uh, collecting some sand for crafting, and I've just hit... 91 magic, which in itself is very impressive, but it does mean I've got one more level until I can use Blood Barrage. So, yeah. Blood Barrage will be really nice for lots of different PVM. So I kind of want to get that as quickly as I can, but I don't really do anything that actively trains magic right now. Alright, so recently I've been quite a filthy casual, and I've pretty much only been playing on RuneScape Mobile, but yeah, this uh, it's going to be a short little slideshow of some of the things that have happened. Uh, firstly, I, uh, there's 525 worlds now, or, well, it goes up to world 525, uh, which I thought was pretty cool. And then, on a hard clue that I did while on mobile, I actually got armor, m the, uh, the final page I need for my Armadil book. So I have that now, which is pretty cool. Uh, the, I also... Shortly after that, there was like an army of pures that turned up in uh, at Cl Clan Wars, which was it was kind of funny to watch. Um, then I noticed I still had an entire looting bag worth of uh, Wines of Zamorak, which would have been nice to have before I uh, finished doing all the herb lore. Then I got a crafting level, did another hard clue, which actually had a pretty cool looking reward in it. It wasn't that helpful, but it looked cool. Uh, and then I tried to fill a crate with my Shazian armor, just to give myself a bit more bank space. Turns out I can't. I'm not sure why. Uh, my guess would be I don't have enough Shazian favor to make uh, tier 5 armor packs. That would be my guess. I'm not actually sure. But yeah, back onto actual clips now. Okay, so I didn't have OBS ready, uh, but I just got 90 Slayer, which... This is the highest layer level that I've ever had in the game. Cold hard cash, nice. 
Right, warm soft cash. Extend dark beasts. 